Today we're standing in front of the Turfgrass Research and Education Center here on the Griffin campus. Over the past several decades, the University of Georgia has assembled a talented, interdisciplinary team of turfgrass scientists to support Georgia's important and diverse turfgrass industry. This recently completed building is part of a three location facilities enhancement project that was funded by the 2014 Georgia Legislature. On behalf of the entire turf team, we'd like to thank the industry for their confidence in our programs and research, the Georgia Legislature and Governor Nathan Deal for the funding of this endeavor, and University of Georgia and College of Ag and Environmental Sciences Administration for their support. Although the majority of the funding from this project was dedicated to the construction of this building behind me, two other important projects were also undertaken. At Tifton, old outdated greenhouses were demolished and replaced with state-of-the-art facilities, including a climate control greenhouse to support the well-known Tifton Turfgrass breeding program led by Dr. Brian Swartz. At Athens, a laboratory-style classroom and associated greenhouse was constructed to support the undergraduate teaching program. My name is Brian Schwartz and I'm the turfgrass breeder in Tifton, Georgia and I just want to thank you and the industry for the support and the building of our new turfgrass facilities in Tifton, Georgia. Our new greenhouse and headhouse will help us better serve the industry, the homeowners, the saw producers, golf course superintendents, sports field managers to produce grasses like we have for the last 60 years in Tifton, whether that's Tifway 419 which has been used everywhere from Georgia to across the globe to Tiff Sport or Tiff Eagle or even our new Bermuda grass, Tiff Tough, which is used out here at Foley Field. We look forward to working on new products in Tifton that will help make your businesses successful in the future, whether that's a Bermuda grass, a zoysia grass, or a centipede grass. We hope to make it better for you. So our new head house is so different from the last one in that it has climate control. It has places for us to work on computers, to enter data, to pot plants, to do so in a fashion that's out of the weather and where we can work in the hot days of summer or the cold days in winter without pause. Our new state-of-the-art greenhouses in Tifton will let us make crosses where we weren't able to do them before so that we can develop new hybrids faster that will be better suited for sports fields like here at Foley Field or Sanford Stadium or home lawns across the state or even the whole United States. The majority of our UGA turfgrass faculty are actually located here on the Griffin campus. The Griffin faculty provide specialized turfgrass expertise in the areas of agronomy, entomology, plant pathology, breeding and genetics, weed science, and plant physiology. The concept for the Griffin campus facility began almost 10 years ago as a plan to replace old and antiquated buildings with a modern facility that could support and house all our turf grass programs under one roof. After demolition of some of our outdated buildings that were present on this site, construction of this building began in January 2016. The architects for this project were Clark Nixon with offices in Macon, and the general contractor was Garber Construction based in Dublin, Georgia. We're fortunate in that our turf grass faculty were actually included in the design process for this facility. And as a result, this building has been uniquely tailored to support the research and educational efforts of seven turf grass scientists, their staff, and graduate students. This facility provides modern and customized laboratories, greenhouses, offices, classroom, and conference facilities. We believe this facility to be among the best in the world and certainly the only one that's been designed specifically to support turf grass research and education. So I'd like to tell you that I'm extremely excited uh, and thankful for the new facility that we've acquired here uh, in Athens. Uh, it allows us to increase our hands-on learning uh, within the courses that I teach in turf grass science. Uh, we use the facility to conduct a lot of demonstrations and experiments that help the students uh, um, understand difficult concepts that we discuss in class. Uh, we also use the facility to help train a lot of our undergraduate turf grass science uh, management majors uh, to compete in national competitions uh, such as the Student Challenge with the Sports Turf Managers Association, along with the uh, Academic Turf Bowl associated with the Golf Course Superintendents Association of America. And uh, finally, I would like to thank anyone that was involved uh, in the acquisition of funding for these projects, not only here in Athens, but in our other campuses, along with the people that were involved in the design and construction of uh, either of these facilities. All members of the UGA Turfgrass team are dedicated to developing new products and sustainable management strategies 
to address the critical needs of Georgia's turf grass industry. Through science and education, it's our intent for turf grass to remain vital to Georgia's economy.